Welcome back to STL TV Live. I'm Christia Parker, and joining me in the studio is Daryl McAdoo. He's the head of school at Proclaris Mastery Academy. How are you doing today? I'm doing well, thanks. Thank you so much for coming. No problem. Thanks for having me. Now, can you tell us a little bit about how you guys got started? Um, where's your school located? Everything. Just how did this come about? Yeah, yeah. So, Proclaris Mastery Academy, we are a 5th through 12th grade honors academy. We will be located in the Grand Arts Center, uh, actually right at Grand in Washington where the Third Baptist Church is. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have been researching and developing in development for about three years. Uh, started off at the Washington University on a business school and we'll be opening up this fall. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Now, you are the head of school at this academy. I am. I how, am. Did, mm -hmm. how, did, how did this happen? Well, uh, I am also the founder of the school. so. I uh, actually kind of pitched this idea at WashU to their Olin School of Business that I had a great idea for a honors academy for the city of St. Louis to help, you know, low income and students of color get into top colleges and graduate from top colleges. And from there, I was able to start a good project team. And then from there, we developed a board and uh, just met a lot of great people that really believed in this mission. And uh, exactly. yeah, made can, it happen. Can you mm -hmm. tell us a little bit about your journey in education? When did you? Mm -hmm. Uh, were you a teacher somewhere else before? Yeah, or? yeah. So I guess my journey in education really, for me, started in high school. So uh, after spending a few years at various different uh, public schools across St. Louis City, I uh, ended up at a really good private school here in the city, and I was able to see uh, just how different uh, a great school uh, or what a great school can do in someone's life. So after that, I got my undergrad at Yale University, and then I got my graduate degree at WashU. In education and I started a college prep program known as New Legacy to help other students of colors get into top colleges and then that also kind of acted as a motivating factor for the school. That's so awesome. Mm -hmm. Now uh, tell us a little bit about Preclaris. First Preclaris. of all tell us where did that name come from? <laughs> yeah yeah so Preclaris it, uh, it's, actually, it's a Latin word so we do actually offer Latin in our curriculum so the students will know what it means uh, as well as a few other words but it means Latin for excellent and striking. Awesome. And why did mm -hmm. why did you name your school for Claire? Well, uh, it sounds cool, but then, uh, <laughs> but but also on top of that, uh, really just really lifting the standard for what for for what a great school should look like. We want an excellent school, and we believe that it's time to have something that St. Louis City uh, can can really. Uh, have a pillar in a community, an excellent striking school that's known across the country. So, awesome. Mm -hmm. um, tell us a little bit about the requirements for students to be able to. Right, right. So visit. right now we are recruiting fifth and sixth grade students, mm -hmm. um, and students. We are giving preferences to students who live in North St. Louis City, as well as students who are low income. We know that that's where the greatest educational need is. Mm -hmm. um, but really, any student that lives in the city of St. Louis can apply and. Uh, they do have a chance of getting into the school. Awesome. What mm -hmm. can students expect? How is Preclaris different from yeah, the yeah. other schools? That's a great question. So we are, A, we're classically inspired, so all students actually take Latin as part of their formal curriculum. Three years of Latin starting in fifth grade, followed by five years in a second uh, uh, foreign language. We are AP intensive, which is advanced placement intensive at our high school program. Um, algebra by eighth grade, AP calculus by twelfth grade year. And uh, we have a no excuses school culture. So no excuses, no tolerance. Everybody performs. Everybody raises to expectations. And uh, you know the big thing is, uh, you know, if you're going to come, you have to head your head on straight. We're not allowing anybody to slip under the bar, and we're not going to lower the standard for any student either. Wow. Mm -hmm. um, so the require is there is. Is there a cost to come to school? Uh, the there or? is no cost. Uh, there is no tuition. So any student that does get accepted into the school will actually have 100% tuition free uh, education provided by Preclaris. Totally awesome. Mm -hmm. Where are you guys located right now? We will be in the Third Baptist Church for the first, uh, first year, possibly the first two years. Uh -huh. And uh, that's actually in the Grand Arts Center right, right across from the Fox Theater. So, And then after that, we do plan on relocating into a residential neighborhood in North St. Louis City. Now, you guys have a school fair coming up. Tell us a little bit about that. We do, we do. Uh, actually, the, a couple of really high-performing schools across uh, the city, uh, all of which are located in North St. Louis City, have gotten together. And Matthew Dickey's Boys and Girls Club is going to host a school fair. So uh, anyone that's interested in pre-K all the way up to 12th grade, there will be over a dozen schools there that you can bring the whole family to and just kind of 
get a chance to speak to school reps, learn more about each school, and then if you find a good fit for your personal uh, son, daughter, then uh, you actually can fill out an application for any of those schools right there in one place. Awesome. Now, mm -hmm. why is it so important now for parents to, you know, really pick out and, and you know, um, judge a school that they're going to send their kids to or, mm -hmm. you know, really be particular about that? Yeah, I mean, uh, to me, I guess, you know, a lot of parents just don't know that they have options, mm -hmm. um, you know, and so it's something that specifically a lot of low income parents don't realize that there are other schools that could be a good fit for their son or their daughter. And in, in a time like this, when, you know, when in not just in education, but we're, we're having a lot of problems across our community and our country, uh, a good school can make a difference. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Now, you guys are all are recruiting. We are. We Tell are. us about that. Yeah, so we are also uh, recruiting for Preclaris Mastery Academy. We are looking for fifth and sixth grade students who will be in the fifth and sixth grade in this upcoming fall and uh, who live within the city limits of St. Louis City. Uh, but we are strongly encouraging students from North St. Louis City to apply. Okay. Mm -hmm. Your school service is grades 5 through 12. Mm -hmm. So are you just starting off with fifth and sixth? As that is correct. So we are just looking for fifth and sixth grade students in this upcoming fall, and we're going to add a grade each year up until 12th grade. So any student that comes with us this year will be with us if they so desire all the way up until they graduate high school. Awesome. Now, mm -hmm. take us a day in the life of a student at Preclaris Academy, Mastery Academy. A day in the life of a student at Preclaris Mastery Academy. Well, you're going to get up pretty early because we start school at 7.50 a.m. Mm -hmm. uh, once you get to school, um, you're gonna have teachers that are gonna press you from the very beginning until the very end. Uh, we have an extended school day, so students don't actually get out of school till five o'clock. But within that time period, we've actually uh, built in extracurricular, so students can actually participate in arts and community service and athletics during their normal school day. Or they can meet with teachers in small groups if they need extra help. They can meet one-on-one -on -one with tutors. And uh, all throughout the day, uh, not, not to mention actually every Wednesday, we actually have a character building or motivational speaking assembly just to get the kids uh, excited about learning and excited about the possibilities that await them uh, both now and in the future. Awesome. Um, and one last, <laughs> one last thing, mm -hmm. uh, just tell us, you know, why is it important for you to have students to come to Preclaris and mm -hmm. tell, you know, encourage the parents to send their kids to the uh, well, school fair and to contact you guys. Yes, definitely do contact us. Uh, it's not just important for us. I believe it's important for our families to know that there are great schools right in this area. And so you don't have to move out to the county. There are schools here that will serve you very well. Uh, please come out to the school fair. You can hear both about Pray Claire's as well as over a dozen other schools, pre-K all the way up to 12th grade that can service your whole family. And hopefully you can find a great fit for you and your children. Awesome. Thank you so much for joining us today and giving us great information about our students and their future. Thank you guys for hanging out with me at SCL TV. I want to thank Sal Martinez for telling us about this wonderful job fair that's coming up. Don't forget, uh, check the site for more information. And also, come back next Thursday right here at STL TV Live. You can catch us on YouTube, on our YouTube channel. You can also friend us on Facebook and make sure that you follow us on Twitter. And remember to keep it locked right here and experience St. Louis. Until next time, I, this is Christia Parker with STL TV.